month's emission of the annual health fair about on the University of the Pacific. Tiffany Hinchy is the co-chair of the event. She joins us live now with the details. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm well, thank you. So what are some of the various uh, things that you have back there? Because I see a lot of people in white lab coats. Yes, so we do have student volunteers out here. We're providing some blood glucose, cholesterol, blood pressure screenings, along with some immunizations. We have free flu shots today. Um, we have some dental screenings, some vision screenings. We offer um, some mental health and asthma screenings as well. We do have education booths. Um, they can help educate on different types of cancers, different types of teas that you can consume. Um, and then we do have vendors out here. Uh, we have a couple organizations promoting their businesses. Um, we have the Food Bank. We have Sacramento County out here. We have a lot going on. What, uh, why did you pick this particular location? You're understanding you're uh, on Elder Creek Row. What is the name of the facility there? Um, it's called Bacos. Uh, we've been coming here uh, regularly every year uh, for the past few years. Um, we work with the Bacos community along with Tito. They help provide this venue for us to use um, for our health. Explain care. what Bacos is, please. Um, it's the Vietnamese American community of Sacramento. There you go. Okay, got it, got it, got it. Okay. Um, are you going to be there all day and this is free? Uh, yes, it is free. We're here from 9.30 a.m. to 3 p.m. Um, so we're out here until 3 p.m. if you'd like to stop by. Okay, very good. Thank you so much, so the UOP students of Pharmacy and Health Science. Yeah, a lot of people out there volunteering their time. Thank you. You've been keeping the plant lady busy with all of your questions. She's been keeping you busy with all her Instagram posts. Well, what do you know about fruit trees?